Hi guys, we've come from the garden and we're here in our cellar and now we're going to store the potatoes um, so they should hopefully last um, for storage for about at least six months that's the, the idea of what we're going to do now we like to store our potatoes in um, sand and this has been uh, sifted through so it's nice and fine um, we have I have sorted out all the smaller potatoes these guys we're going to um, uh, boil up as new potatoes and for salad and we're going to put these into some stews which we shall make and then we'll put in the freezer um, so we can defrost them and heat them up in the winter time so that's those guys now we've got these big guys here which uh, are all about the average size a few big ones in there but the main idea is to place them into your sand So the concept of this is keeping them dry, keeping them dark, and it keeps them from uh, going off and getting disease. And obviously you want to store these as long as possible. So you're basically putting them into your sand now we've had to use a um like a, a kid's sand pit um but yes you can use something that's a wee bit more organized it's a kind of um we've had to kind of use this because we've not got anything else but in the future i'm going to make something that's a wee bit more um practical as it were so you make a layer like so. So you basically want them not touching too much, but there's a bit of a, a gap between them. There we go. And then I have some more sand in the bucket here. and you just cover them over. And we just do it in like a, in layers. So the sand will, um, will stop any moisture because if there's any moisture, then the potatoes will want to sprout and they'll start um, creating eyes with what you do not want. So keep them dry and they won't shrivel up. Like so. And then we just do the next layer. Now we, this year we actually got a really good harvest of potatoes so we're really pleased. Because they're very useful for all sorts of things. Although it's just the, um, my daughter Isla and I have really eating the potatoes because um, my wife Carlene is on a special diet. It's handy because then in the, um, over the next six months when you just want the potatoes, you just come into your cellar and grab what potatoes you want. And it's obviously ideally to do it in your cellar because it's nice and cold. Okay. 
good. And I'll just carry on with the next the um the next level. Right guys, this is the last layer of the uh, um sand that's gonna go on. And I'm just gonna completely cover so you can't see any of the potatoes. Like so. That's looking good. And just make sure you can't really see any of them. Because you don't want to see any light. Although we do have a window in our cellar, but we have it blocked off. So um, there's a small amount of light that gets in. But once you've got the sand in here, um, we'll put a... There we go, that's nice and covered. And I have a piece of cardboard here, which I will put all over here like so. And um, I don't know if I can move this in. No, not just yet. So there's our cover of that. I'll slide this under and cover that so there's no light that gets underneath. And then the, um, and that'll be then all sorted, which is cool. Excellent. Okay, well, this is the end of the video. Uh, thanks for watching. And um, please leave a comment down below. And um, please share my video if you like it. And uh, most importantly, if you can please subscribe, that would be really good for my channel. And um, I'll see you in the next video. Cheers. Bye.